Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you where you can configure SharePoint search settings. So first of all, let me show you what I'm talking about. Uh, so when you execute a search in SharePoint, maybe you are searching a given SharePoint site, or maybe you are searching the entire SharePoint, uh, the results will be presented uh, based on default settings uh, within SharePoint. However, sometimes you might want uh, to tweak the behavior. So let me give you an example. So for example, I'm on this uh, client ABCD site and I'm searching for something on the site. I guess I don't have any documents that match this criteria, but that's fine. By default, you get to see all those different tabs, right? All those different tabs that allow you to filter your content uh, even further. Uh, let me show you uh, the site where I actually configured some uh, search settings already. I'm going to execute a search. I'm getting some results, but if you notice, some of the tabs, all right, have been uh, eliminated, all right? Essentially, I removed some of the default tabs and actually introduced my own you know, custom tab that only searches, uh, in this case, for some PDF documents. Uh, let me show you another scenario. Maybe you're searching, you know, the entire SharePoint, all right? And of course, once again, you can search for any keyword, but you know what, I'm just going to search, you know, uh, for this particular keyword, but look at this, I typed in password, and uh, in addition to giving me all the results, you know, for all the files and pages and any content that matches the board password, it decided to uh, essentially uh, promote this certain result, uh, how to change the password, right? An article uh, with instructions, how to promote uh, the password. So essentially this is the type of customization I'm talking about. And that's uh, what I would like to explain in this video. Now, of course, I'm not going to explain how to configure all the settings. Um, I will probably record separate videos on those. For now, I just want to show you the locations where you can tweak those settings. Um, there are actually two places, all right? Um, so first of all, uh, if you want to configure, you know, essentially search settings just for a site, that's one place. You can also configure the search settings globally for the whole tenant. So once again, two locations where you can tweak settings, you can configure them at the site level and those search settings will only apply to the site, uh, that particular site, or you can uh, tweak the settings globally for the whole SharePoint for the whole tenant. Let me show you those two locations. So if you want to tweak the settings at the site level, you just navigate to that site, click the gear icon, site information. Obviously you need to be the site owner, all right? Regular members cannot tweak such settings. And you click on view all settings. And at the bottom under Microsoft search, click configure search settings. And essentially this is the area where you can tweak uh, the behavior, the uh, search experience for this particular site. All right, just this particular site. And there are a few elements you can tweak here. Once again, I will record separate videos on those later, but uh, just to give you a sense, for example, if I want to tweak the tabs, right? Those horizontal tabs that allow you to filter results, this is where you do it. This is where you do it, all right? Uh, so that's where you can fig configure uh, essentially search settings uh, for the site. Now, if you want to impact global search experience, essentially you want to tweak it globally for the whole tenant, you need to click on nine dots uh, and we need to navigate to uh, admin. Uh, and obviously in this case, you do need to be a global Microsoft 365 admin, all right? Uh, if you're just a regular site owner, uh, uh, you know, you need to be the global admin for this. Uh, so click show all, all admin centers. And where you want to click is search and intelligence. Uh, that's a special admin center uh, where you can control the search experience and you actually get to see, um, you know, many, many different customization options. All right, uh, and uh, in addition to uh, some of the ones we'll have already seen uh, on the site, you do have a lot more capabilities here in terms of providing acronyms and uh, creating Q&A type of deal. This is, by the way, an area where, remember, when I showed you how to change password, that result was promoted. Uh, this is it. This is where I essentially provided the question, uh, the keywords, um, you know, when uh, this 
particular result will be triggered as well as the answer essentially the url to point people to uh, if you want to promote certain results but a uh, long story short you can actually do lots and lots of different customizations once again i will record uh, you know videos on those separate topics down the road uh, on my youtube channel uh, but for now i just wanted to show you uh, essentially the two locations where you can configure the search settings site level as well as standard level and that's pretty much it for this particular video so once again hopefully you learned something new as always happy to see you on my blog sharepointmaven.com as well as my youtube channel thank you very much have a great rest of the day goodbye